Hello class, how are you? Yes ma'am. I hope you will be fine. Yes ma'am. Our today story is, Buzz the Buzzard. Let's start the story. Buzz the Buzzard As Buzz the Buzzard began to grow, he became more and more curious. Soon his curiosity led him away from home to a strange new place, a place without the love of his family. It didn't take Buzz long to realize what he was missing and what he really wanted. Welcome stranger. I'm Buzz the Buzzard. You must be here for some advice. But I have to tell you the old water hole has dried up, there's no fast food restaurants, and the closest hotel is 100 miles due south. Now, how can I be of assistance? Ah, uh, I understand. You're just waiting for the Red Rock tour bus. Then you saw me, and decided to have a closer look. Well, while you are here, let me give you some advice. It's free. There is nothing more important than your family. That's it. Oh, I guess I could add that friends could be considered your family. Your family doesn't just have to be your mom and dad, or step-parents, or brother, or sisters or cousins, aunts, and uncles. Well, you get the idea. Your family is all the people who love you and all those you love. What's that, little one? How do I know? Well, it is a long and sad story but I will make it short since I see your bus coming down the road. Not long ago, the sky around these parts was full of buzzards. Yep, my family. One day I decided that living out here just wasn't enough. I wanted to go to the big city. Now my family begged me to stay. They told me how much they loved me, how much they needed me, they reminded me of all the good times. But I didn't listen. Off to the big city I went. But it wasn't long before I knew that I had made a mistake. No one loved me in the big city. I had no family and I was all alone. But I was lucky because I could just flap my wings and head back home. Back home to my family. And that's just what I did. I don't know what happened but when I got home there was no one to greet me. No family, no friends, just empty space. Oh, I see your bus is here so go on, get along, but remember. There is nothing more important than your family. The bus pulled up, came to a stop, the doors opened, and buzzes. Family stepped out carrying souvenirs from the big city. We all went looking for you and are we glad you're home, Betty. Buzzard said with a smile. As Buzz the buzzard began to grow, he became more and more curious. Soon his curiosity led him away from home to a strange new place, a place without the love of his family. It didn't take Buzz long to realize what he was missing and what he really wanted. This is our today story. I hope you enjoyed the story. We will meet in the next class with new story. Thank you class. Goodbye.